Welcome to the exciting world of bungee jumping. We will now be jumping off a building. Look at these pristine 2D PlayStation 1 graphics. Awesome. Wee! You're supposed to press left, right, up and down to do combos and moves as you jump. And that's it. That's the game. I like how the cars in the background are just perpetually frozen in, in time. It's great. It's like everyone has just stopped because they're so shocked and amazed. Someone is jumping off a building and doing flips. Even the CPUs in the game are amazed by this game. Let's try another one. There's the frozen cars again. This is going to be fun. Yay. Fun. After playing this game, I feel like I want to bungee jump just without the rope. Or maybe with the rope by tied around my neck. Just just get creative with the bungee jumping. Yes. I just bungee jumped. We I'd love to show you an insta replay, but every single uh, bungee jump look exactly the same, no matter uh, where you jump off from. I'm gonna basically show you all the levels in this game. Here we are at the Hoover Dam. I'm gonna be jumping off there. Yay. Yay, fun. You see, it's exactly the same. There's the power meter. It measures how strong you jump. I don't know. I Crazy me, I always assume gravity does all the work, but apparently there's a power meter and uh, there's someone doing flips. Yes, this is the world of professional bungee jumping. You know, I honestly never uh, saw anyone doing like like flips while bungee jumping. That seems incredibly dangerous, but what do I know? I'm just a game reviewer. I'm not a professional bungee jumper like uh, Tito Ortiz here hanging upside down, not moving. I think he's dead, actually. I think the little bungee man is dead. I think he snapped his uh, neck there. Alright, let's try another level now. Look how happy that guy looks. He looks like he's jumping off the moon. He's like flying through uh, the sky. Whee! It's like, why doesn't the game look like that? And, and I'm sure you're gonna notice that the game starts off the little intro, every single intro. Oh, here we are at the uh, at the uh, Roadrunner cartoon, apparently. Meep meep. Uh, every single intro starts off in this 3D map. So they created a 3D map for this horrendous, I don't even want to call it a game, this horrendous thing that you play. And um, they don't use the 3D aspects. Once you're in the gameplay, it's 2D. I mean, I could see some fun could be had with this game if it was 3D, maybe a little bit. But this is nothing! Why was this released by a studio, two studios no, no less, when this is just one of the worst things ever? Like, nobody would play this for free on a Flash gaming site in, in 1999. For this to be released in the... It, I guess this is... I forget, I think it's like 2008 or something. I know it was released in the 2000s, after 2005, I'm sure of that. Here's the last level. We're jumping off the balloon. This is the highest altitude, and you're gonna notice one thing. Nothing changes! I might as well literally bungee jump from the moon, like I said earlier, because it'll look the same. It's always we jumping off and falling and doing... I don't even know what I'm pressing. I'm apparently doing combos. I'm just pressing buttons randomly, left, right, up, and down, and that gives me a high, higher score if I don't, you know, uh... There's me bungee jumping. So yeah, don't play this game. Uh, sorry for this video. Stay tuned for the next horrible game review. Toodles.